Hello and welcome back to Wargaming with me, Gary. I've got that just a little bit too big there. Oh, that's better. Right, just so you can see. Right, so these are the finished Egyptians. Uh, I've got 24 there. They're all from Warlord Games. And they're on my newish, because uh, you've already seen it, uh, War Games uh, mat. And I'm... I'm I'm pleasantly pleased with them to be honest. I think they look very good. I'll uh, I'll zoom in a little bit just so you can have a look. I've got the uh, the four um, command bases, if you like, at the front. There's um, so we go in just a little bit. Oops. There we are. So the uh, two standard bearers. I think um, I can't find anywhere where it confirms it, but I, I'm, I'm not sure. I think they. Sometimes use this guy uh, with the feathers to wave for um, for different commands. I know they've got the trumpeter, but um, yeah, but I think that's what they do. Uh, then there's the other standard bearer over there. There's the um, the officer and the guy with the 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 trumpet or whatever. Let me just pick him up. Behind them, there's two rows, or two ranks, if you like, of uh, Egyptian warriors with spears, shields, and daggers, like those carved, those curved, um, like knife-like daggers that the Egyptians used to use into battle. Uh, so there's 20 of them with four, four in the command base. I've gone with, the colour scheme is, as you can see, blue. Um, so the blue shields uh, and the uh, white and blue head scarves. Uh, which are you know specific to the the uh, the core that they're going to be part of. Uh, I will do when I do more of these, and I I was asked. I think it was by um, uh, Brush and Quill uh, if I was um, was it Brush and Quill? Oh, I'm getting in trouble now. But um, I was asked if I would be getting any chariots. I will. I will get some chariots for the Egyptians. But not at the moment because I'm concentrating on the ancient Syrians. But I will get some. So yeah. So uh, so that's something for me to look forward to doing. Um, yeah. So so I will. But um, I'll be getting the ancient. Sir I've got to concentrate on getting the ancient and Syrian armies finished first, or I want to finish uh, getting them finished first. Uh, but there will be some chariots in the ancient Syrians. There, there'll be lots of there'll be the cavalry. Um, uh, chariots both uh, two horse and four horse chariots I'll have archers there'll be slingers lots of spearmen uh, guard uh, heavy, heavy infantry so there'll be a lot of uh, ancient Syrians when I get around to doing it but at the moment that's where, where I'm at with my uh, Egyptians and I'm quite pleased one thing I have just noticed uh, and I'm going to have to do it you, like you, anyone with an eagle eye will notice that I've got four now let me just bring it up Focus. Yeah. Now that that boss in the middle, I've not I've not painted bronze, so I'll do, I will do that immediately, and then I will put that out and varnish the whole lot. So that's me done. I'm um, with the ancient Egyptians. I'm going to go through everything, uh, everything I painted, and then I'm going to put them all out on on the table, so you can see just how much work I've done. Uh, in order to get these, in order to finish this project. Okay, well that's me done, and I'll speak to you all soon. Only it's only four minutes, which is uh, quite good because that means it will load up quicker. All right, I'll see. Speak to you soon. Take care. Bye bye.